Good morning, Independence. Here are your announcements for Thursday, April 7th. Attention juniors and seniors, prom tickets are on sale now. You can purchase tickets during each lunch period. Remember, tickets will not be sold at the door. If you have any questions, see Coach Alexander. The special needs class took to the outdoors to help us out by planting vegetables for our salads at lunch. This is Austin with IHS Media, and today in Miss Dawn's class, we're outside planting this beautiful garden. Let's go see what they're doing. My students are building a raised bed garden with the hopes of making the teacher salad bar uh, sustainable through the crops that we grow here in uh, both of these beds. Plus it's a great way to learn about uh, math and science and incorporate other forms of language into their daily program. Hopefully we'll see some maturing around the, the middle of April that we'll be able to harvest and uh, take to uh, the cafeteria manager. Putting a car, uh, garden for our school for our lunch room. Uh, lettuce, uh, strawberry, and peas. Do you guys think it looks pretty level? Yes. Y'all think it looks pretty level? Okay. We're talking about today what the plan of homemade lettuce. We love Sorry about Sally. I love Sally. Thank you. I like my dad. Uh oh. All right. Try to keep it in. In the middle. We need to plant netters and all of us for donate festivals in our school. Our society bar. Three minutes ago. We learned. Weed and plants and, and dig and, and, and water. I learned a lot today about lettuce and planting. Back to you, Colton. Thanks, Austin. There are less than 100 copies of the 2011 yearbook remaining. The sales period will end on April 11th. To ensure you get your copy, use one of two easy ways to pay. Go to yearbookordercenter.com or call Herf Jones at 866-280-3096. Do not place orders through the school. Be sure to order directly through Herf Jones. The yearbook staff will not be accepting any checks made out to IHS for pre-order. Mr. Finley's physics class decided to celebrate Albert Einstein's birthday by baking cakes in his honor. Albert. He's a pretty famous guy. He took me five hours of hard labor and uh, I handmade it. It's the first time I ever made a cake. I'm pretty proud of it. And, uh, So I did Albert Einstein. It's a uh, it's yellow cake covered in uh, buttercream frosting and vanilla frosting. And for his nose and his eyebrows, I use Rice Krispie treats. <laughs> It's March 14th, so it's Einstein's birthday. He's, he's 132 this year, and uh, with the math department doing Pi Day and everything being Pi, we are we're much more into cake here in physics. Cake is a uh, well, it's better than pie anyway. So as part of the honors portfolio, they had to they had several options, and one of the options was to create a birthday cake for Albert Einstein. And so here they are, and we have had cake, and it was good. Good. Mm-hmm. No, that does. Happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you, happy birthday dear Einstein, happy birthday to you. Change is coming to Independence. Have you heard about it? Find out more about it today after school in the library. You can make a difference. You can change the world. 
Seniors, are you going to college or into the military? Mrs. McCombs needs this information ASAP. Graduation is soon and this information is needed for our records and the graduation program. Seniors, if you've not picked up your cap and gown, please see Mrs. McCombs in the Counseling Center. Now let's throw it over to Graham on sports. Hey Chess, Graham Sawyer here with Your New Sports. If you are interested in trying out for the 2011-2012 dance team, please come by room D125 today to get a packet. Clinic will be Monday through Wednesday. Tryouts will be on Thursday next week. Make sure you have all your forms ready to turn in on Monday. The CHS-IHS lacrosse team has a game at Independence High School tonight at 7. Come out and support them. Kev's back. Let's see what he's got to say today. Hey, what's up, Indy? I know I've been gone for a while, but I've had some other things on my mind. Right now, my heart is beating faster than any workout has ever done. And that's saying a lot. All right, it's time to cut to the chase. Mackenzie, would you like to go to prom with me? All right, well, that's it for me. We'll get back to working out next week. Later. Aww. Well, that's all for me this week. Back to you, Colton. Thanks, Graham. Attention seniors, every senior needs to stop by the library during the next two weeks to check out for outstanding library fines, check for missing and or lost textbooks, and get the amount you owe and pay your bill to be clear to graduate. Even if you think you do not owe anything, you need to check. These amounts accumulate from the time you are a freshman. Cat is doing the same thing they usually do, building stuff. The students were to research uh, bridge designs and find one that they particularly like. They were to uh, write a paper about this, the bridge and uh, tell me about the design of the purpose of the bridge, where the bridge is at, uh, and then take inspiration from that bridge and apply it to their designs in AutoCAD of their own bridge and then build it in AutoCAD, or, or draw, it, draw a scale drawing in AutoCAD and then ultimately build it and then test it to see how much weight it holds. We had to make blueprints, like we had to make our own like design of it, and then we had to use 15 pieces of balsa wood and a thing, just like a small thing of glue, and build the bridge. It was good. We made a bridge out of balsa wood and uh, had to glue it together and had to hold a certain amount of pounds. So. My bridge was good except for the fact that I didn't pass inspection because I put my uh, wood together so and it didn't hold too much. It held about a good, uh, good eight. If I was a bridge, I would collapse just to mess with people. The next PBS drawing includes more prom tickets. If you are interested in going to prom without paying, put your tickets in the correct box. The next drawing is Monday, April 11th, and the prizes are two couples can win free prom tickets, two individuals can win free prom tickets, valet parking for prom, and 10 free drinks or 10 free blow pops from Indy's Corner Store. There will be a meeting for new members of the National Honor Society Tuesday morning in Mr. Raglan's room D121 at 7. All new members should plan on attending. That's all for today's announcements. Have a great day, Independence. Thank you.